Hi, thanks for your interest in Conestoga College's Robotics and Automation Program, a program that's been providing successful and exciting careers for students for quite some time. I'm here to bring you through a few of the highlights and get you started on your path towards a decision. And get a program. I just need to get this presentation running. And again, introduction to Robotics and Automation. My name is John Thielmans. I'm the coordinator for the program. It's a three-year advanced diploma. We're located in the School of Trades and Technology at the Cambridge campus. Um, I've been here for 22 years and I want my six students to succeed. We've been doing a very good job of getting our students to pass through the program and end up traveling the world and having a wonderful time with their career. So I'm very proud of what we've accomplished here. And better than 90% grad placement in the entire 22 years I've been here is amazing. Even this year, uh, this past year with the uh, COVID crisis, we had excellent placement. I've never seen it below 90%. And that is because designing and installing automation is one of the most secure careers at this point because robots are not going away. And because it's a co-op program, students have their jobs lined up while they're still at school. So there's less stress on them to finish school and they can just breeze through the program um, with confidence. Salary and travel opportunities are amazing and you get to play with some really cool toys. It is a lease your own device program, which means tuition includes a lease of a computer that is powerful enough to run all the software you could possibly need for our program. We support service and software, so it's all included. And as the program, as, as you get closer to the program, if you do lease your own device, you will be given the information how to load the software and get started. Uh, there are virtual tours on our website. If you want to take a look, take, uh, go to the links and uh, see what the labs look like. But the highlight of the program really is our third year capstone projects. Each year, our graduating students are uh, tasked with conceiving, designing, and building a machine much like the one you see running in the back. This is a third year project from a couple of years ago that uh, was assembling the inserts for beehives. And everything you see happening in the video was designed and constructed by the students. We have a supply room full of uh, parts, mechanisms, we have robots and they build it into the system that is performing tasks similar to the one behind me. So they do everything, the programming, the building, the machining, it's all them. Every project starts with an empty room. So everything you see in the videos is completely done by the students. And this is why local employers consider our graduates to be job ready. When they leave our campus, they're ready to work. Um, there's a multitude of, of projects you can look at on our website, my website, to find the website, you can go to YouTube and search for Conestoga Robotics Projects. Then you simply select the link with the Conestoga logo, Conestoga Robotics Projects, and it has basically a, a gallery of videos, projects that my students have done, or you can go to the URL that's listed here on this page. Um, definitely worth a look. It's, it's something that the faculty and staff here are really proud of, just watching the students complete and operate these amazing machines. And again, this is what makes them job ready. Graduates will earn anywhere from 60 to 65,000 per year. Some do more, but this is an average. Um, job availability, I think that's like I've shown here, robotics programmer, automation designer, system integrator, which is someone that combines all the systems, basically puts all these things together. Automation and vision system specialists, they'll be traveling around the world if they'd like, installing machines, troubleshooting machines, or upgrading uh, automated systems anywhere that they're built. I wish I could answer all your questions here, but I can't. So I'm hoping you reach out to me later if you have any. Um, but a few of the typical questions I receive are, do we need to find our, co our own co-op? And no, because we have our own co-op department here in the college that finds jobs for students. It will uh, Hold local employers, find positions, then we'll post them on an internal website so students can actually apply to them, interview. They still need to interview, and it's up to them to earn the job, but we will find the openings. You're more than welcome to find your own job as well. That's not off the table. So either way works for us, as long as you get something that is related to the field. And uh, there's no shortage of those. Should you work part-time during school? You can, but uh, we ask that you limit it to 20 hours or less per week so you succeed at school and succeed at work too. Um, we do work fairly hard, but the results are so worth it. All of our grads are so happy. Do you need to bring your laptop to school? No, I'd rather not. Um, 
We have computer labs that have all the software you need, so you can leave your laptop at home. It's safer, you won't drop it, you won't lose it. And many faculty actually don't like you to use laptops in class. We, uh, we feel it's a distraction from the material. So the laptops do not need to come with you every day. Call out to paid, yeah, 20 to $30 an hour is typical, but some are more. Uh, if you have any more questions, some of them may be answered on our webpage through the college homepage. And if not, by all means, contact me. I'm happy to help you with any questions you may have. You can call, well, phone right now doesn't work very well, but uh, Zoom phone call or Zoom meeting, email, or even a telephone call we can arrange through and, and as you know, contact me anytime. I'm happy to talk to you about anything you need for the future. Your future, control the robots. Thank you very much.